Hello everybody, my name is Skywar Speedy and welcome to a Far Cry Primal video. This is a work in progress build of the game. And look at that big kitty cat, guys. Look at that big- I was so happy we killed that elephant type thingy. And then he just started eating my mates. Like, what's up with that? You know, I wasn't too excited with that. But I had a ton of fun in this game. I'm down to share my adventures with you guys today because they need to be shared, they need to be narrated, and you guys need to see what all went down in this game because some scary, some crazy things happen. Lots of ups and downs. At one point I start fighting two bears that were fighting each other, but I thought it'd be fun to catch them on fire and then fight them, and that... You'll see how that goes later. But anyway, guys, this is Far Cry Primal, and let me share my adventures with you. So here's my elephant buddy. I thought he was pretty cool, and at first I was going to be nice with the enemies. And by the way, that person back there was shooting me because I shot him first. He was supposed to be my teammate, but I really messed that up. And then the elephant killed me, and then it curb stomped me, so that's really good. And at this point, I'm not really feeling like I want to be cool with the animals anymore. So I start off by finding this little dog-like thing, and I kind of just have my way with it, which is kind of messed up. I'm sorry if this offends anyone, but... Well, we'll talk about this guy later, you know? I bring him back, don't worry about him, you know? That's no big deal. And I'm still mad at the animals at this point, and this is this one's just cruel. Like, this one made me even feel bad. This is what changes my the narrative of my story at this point. Watch this, guys. This is just messed up. Like, look, look how sad I am. I couldn't help but be sad, you know? Poor little guy didn't deserve it. So then I meet this chick, and she's like, pissed off. Like, what's her problem, you know? I, I'm just wandering into this cave, but whatever. Anyway, I grab fire to kill her, but then Mr. Kitty Cat comes out of nowhere. So then I have to be all like, oh my god, I'll save you and stuff. So I kind of like save her. And then basically just tell her to run, because at this point, it's up to me to use my fire stick and scare this kitty cat away. Which kind of makes me sad that me and the kitty cat couldn't get along, because I really like cats. Like, look at that. Look at that big saber tooth thingy. And she just climbs it behind a rock, and I'm like, that's a good idea. Maybe I swing some fire and join you real quick. Look at that escape, guys. Are you proud of me? That's a cutscene. But I'm gonna take credit for it, you know? Why not? And she didn't do a single thing. So after all that hard work, it's only fitting that I wipe the sweat off my forward and start moving forehead. I put the order out of words on purpose, don't worry. So now at this point, I'm just walking along a field, right? Having a grand old time. And then this happens. I love cats! I said it before! And this one just started attacking me! It also happened to be ten times cuter than the one we fought earlier, which really pissed me off. So then I had to start smacking it naturally, and then it ran back to where it came from. But don't worry, Speedy's gonna find it. And I did find it. And there he is, and he dies. And now it's time to gut the thing. So look at my evil face as I do it! Now it's the time of day that you were all waiting for. Speedy's gonna find a bear! And I found one honey dicking! Look at him! He's in the honey jar! But I accidentally shoot the honey jar instead of him! It was a mistake! I'm gonna cut out the part where the bees start attacking me because of my mistake, and now it's time to take a stealthy approach of me sneaking up on the bear here. Now you're gonna see what to do and what not to do with the bear. Taking a distance shot at his head is probably a smart tactic. So then he hits me with this look. He's not happy, right? But luckily, I get the most lucky position spot in the world. Look at this. This rock saves my life so hard to the point it can't get to me anymore, and then it's time to fire stick the guy to death. Look at this, guys. I killed the first bear I ever encountered, and naturally, being a bad gamer, I catch myself on fire looking at my kill. But hey, you can't win them all, right? So I'm hungry. I want more. Why not two more? This is what I alluded to earlier. Two bears is bad enough. Let's just catch them both on fire real quick because I'm a genius. So that's good. And here we go. Let's catch this guy on fire if I can ever catch up to the guy. Come on back here, buddy. This was the most terrifying moment ever, because I have bear chasing me. Another bear that I just need to catch on fire because I'm an idiot. It, like, like, why did I think this was a good idea? I'm obviously gonna die here. I can hardly beat one bear by himself. Did I? Holy crap, I, did. I never realized I actually killed one of them. Oh my god, I'm amazing. I can't believe I killed one. I'm so happy. Go me. I fought two fiery bears at once and I lost Joel. So then I meet this guy, and I'm kind of at a loss for words at this point. I really don't know how to describe this other than... I met Wolfman. So then he decides to whine and dime me by making me drink my own blood and I guess this chili mixture, which was honestly, if, if we're gonna be honest, it was pretty good. I'm not even too mad about it. But then I start tripping balls and he's just like rubbing it in that he's such a good chef that his food has this effect on me. And then, like any time you eat chili, I woke up with all these golden animals, which I was really happy about. And I'll let you guys have my experience of this. I don't know what I'm doing. I found golden animals, but I love it. Isn't he adorable? He loves me. I'm actually doing the story, man. You're probably just biting bears and shit. Joel, look, I found a whole 
happy family of golden deer. Dude, Joel, I found the owl. I got the owl. I'm gonna be able to summon that bitch ass owl. Joel, you gotta do this, man. Oh, I think I. Okay, Joel, don't do it like I did. <laughs> so yeah, apparently you're not supposed to just dive bomb into the water. You're supposed to follow the thing around, which I did, and then I tamed this awesome owl. So now I can tame animals. So you guys remember that little doggy I killed earlier, brutally, just straight up murdered it and then set it on fire. Well, I brought him back to life. I dyed him white. And I tamed him, so he's cool with me now. Also, he grew a little bit in stature, but that's no big deal. And look, look, look how cute he is. You can't, you can't not like that. Look, look at that little guy. So then, I have him kill everyone for me now, and it's just a beautiful friendship. I don't have to get dirty, and he seems to like it. Look at his little battle cry. And now, watch this. This is true friendship. First off, look at these, look at these gaming skills. And then, guys, right here, let him take the floor for me. Watch this. Sit back and watch. Bay comes to save the day. That's what I like to see. And then he can he can gloat all he wants. But I got sick of him. And now I tamed a bear. And now it's time for my bear to kill a saber-toothed tiger. But unfortunately, my bear has a bad owner. Oh, cool. I try to help and I catch my bear on fire. That's how bad I am. So now it's time for me to tame a kitty cat. So I choose this one, all right? I love him. He goes for the bait. All I have to do is go up onto him, hit tame. But then this happens! Like, why? Why do bad things happen to people that like cats? I just wanted this little guy. Look, look at this. It's brutal. I'm pretty sure a cat just ate me. It was brutal. So there you have it. That's my adventure in Far Cry Primal so far. I know there's a lot more to do in the game, and unfortunately, I didn't have time to do all that. And even when I did have time to do it, I kind of just focused on the furry animals because I really like them. But I look forward to doing some more cool stuff with the game. Thank you to Ubisoft for inviting me out to play it early. I had a ton of fun with it. If you guys want to learn more about the game, click the annotation on the screen. Or you can click the links in the description. Those will take you to cool places too. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. I hope you guys enjoyed a little something different. I don't normally do videos like this, so it was fun to do it for me. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I know a lot of you guys like the face cams and stuff, so that's always cool too. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time, and take care.